time. So Gaffer, um, tough one to take that one, I can imagine. Absolutely. I mean, it's uh, it's a feeling of, of uh, frustration and hurt for. I'm devastated for the boys. But also, I feel, I feel tremendously proud. So it's a very, very strange uh, mixture of emotions I'm feeling at the minute. And like the performance-wise, you must be quite happy with it. Like with ten men for the majority of the game, and to come back and equalise, and then really we we dominate the majority of the second half. I'm sure it's fair to say that. Absolutely magnificent. Um, had the man sent off. Uh, not really sure about it. Not until I see it, I can't really comment on it. Um, the, the problem is we went one. We, we started the game well, 11 v 11. We go one 0 down to a poor goal. We got to stop stop conceding poor goals like that. Um, but then with 10 men, we went 4-3-2, kept two up the pitch, really brave. Fitness levels were good. We dominated possession, dominated the whole game. And uh, listen, we were the better team, but we've come away with nothing. So. Is it a bit of a bitter pill to swallow? Though? It they is, absolutely. The boys are devastated in there. Um, and it feels like it's doom and gloom, but that, that, that is a proper, proper football performance. I thought some of our individual performances were absolutely outstanding. Um, I, I had men on the pitch, um, leaders our fitness, our passing, our desire. Um, we've, t we've hit the post, we've hit the bar, scored the penalty. Um, we've had other chances. Um, our desire to keep uh, a clean sheet in the second half is evident. Uh, we won most aerial duels, we won most tackles. Um, but <laughs> but Taunton have, have scored at the end and, and um, they, they've got the three points, so fair play. And for you, do you you, you're looking back on the first half, obviously, the, the red card. Do you think that changed the game a little bit? Uh, well, it, well, it did. It changed the game because you want 11 v 11. But with 10 men, I thought we were the superior team. But it's all well and good saying that. It's just it's, it's football words. And we've got to keep the ball out in the net. And at the end, the boys are just flat out on their feet. Um, and uh, and Taunton, you know, the, the boy finishes it well at the end. So it's a, it's a horrendous body blow. Uh, really does feel like that. But... Listen, I'm, I'm not worried about anything. I think we're a brilliant football team, um, and our desire and our, our, you know, that honestly, just really, really proud. I thought the boys were absolutely magnificent. And especially considering you played a tough game on Saturday, 90 minutes, and then literally, it's, it's relentless, isn't it? Yeah, it is relentless. But our fitness levels are great. The boys have obviously recovered well in, in between, done the right things. Um, phew, it's just, it's a tough one, mate. It's a tough one. But if you don't stop crosses, don't stop the ball coming in the box, and you're always at. You're always at danger of conceding, um, you know. But tough one to take that. And I know, I know you didn't. Obviously, we didn't win the game today. You were you were really dejected. I think it's fair to say on off on Saturday after the game. Um, I know you weren't particularly happy performance-wise, but you seem a lot happier today with the performance. I, I, how can you not be? And anyone who was here at this game today says we weren't the better team. Is deluded, absolutely deluded. But Taunton have won two-one. And obviously looking ahead now, Exmouth next yeah, week. Yeah, yeah. A week it's nice to have a week's rest. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, we, we normally train on Tuesday. We won't train, obviously, we won't train tomorrow. We'll train Thursday. Um, worry about Exmouth on Saturday in the FA Cup then. Um, and then we've got another free week and we start the league action. So it's important to start picking up some wins.